Now, on tonight, we're getting a dramatic look at a confrontation inside a Twin Cities police station. Drop that knife. Drop that. Put that down. Put it down! The tense moments last fall in Burnsville started when a bloodied, suicidal man walked in with a knife. The situation lasted several seconds, but it seemed much longer as the confrontation escalated. James Shugel shares what happened next and why police call the technology that's letting us see it all a game changer. We often only hear about a police emergency afterwards. What happened to your neck? This time, we get to see the situation unfold. Hey, stop. Drop that knife. Exactly as officers saw. Drop that. Put that down. Put it down! I drew my gun thinking, I need to shoot this guy to protect me. Officer Dave Lutzinger had just finished preparing a report when a suicidal man entered the police station. 1033 inside the PD lobby. Man with a knife, he's cut up. He's been a cop six years, but never experienced something this dramatic. I can tell the urgency in his voice. Nor is Officer Brad Lickey, who heard the call for help. As soon as we opened the door, I see this guy standing, you know, literally right in front of me. Hey, stay back, stay back, stay back, stay back! Seconds later, Officer Licky pushed open the lobby door again. Drop the knife. And shot the man with his taser. The situation was over. This is the camera itself, but far from forgotten because of this camera Officer Lutzinger wears. We've got uh, a recording of what we were doing and what other people were doing. Just, we have two honorees today. Recently, both officers received awards of honor for how they handled the situation. Sometimes we have to do some pretty difficult and challenging things, so it's, it's good to be recognized for that. Roll on your stomach, roll on your stomach. Both kept themselves from getting hurt. Put your hands behind your back. And put an end to a frightening situation. About two dozen Burnsville officers wear those cameras now. The chief there calls them a game changer because if anyone questions an incident, they can just go to the tape. The video you just saw tonight, Amelia, is going to be used for future training for other officers too. It's pretty intense, James, to see something like that unfold. Absolutely. It lasted several seconds, but they said it felt like it lasted much longer yeah. than that. All right. Thank you.